freeing yourself from anything that's holding you back. It could be anything, 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 anything from gambling to drinking, from shopping, anything, to cheating on your spouse, anything. It could be anything. But you have an option to change it. If you're still alive, you're still breathing, God gave you an opportunity to correct it. Correct it. That means making amends to people who, who, who have said that you have harmed them. You can't say you didn't. <laughs> you can say that was not your intention. Or I didn't mean to. But you can't say no I didn't. Because they're telling you that's what you did. You are not them. So you can't say how they feel. So if it was not your intentions then say that. Say that was not my intentions. But if that was your intentions to do that, then you just got caught, so you need to just change who you are. And it ain't going to be easy. Just work on it. There was a lot of things that I didn't appreciate about myself. I didn't I didn't like the fact that I hurt people. I didn't like the fact that people thought I was a bully. I didn't like the fact that people thought that I, I, I thought they were down like or beneath me. I didn't like none of that. But understand, there is an exception to that. You will come across people that will project it onto you because they feel a certain kind of way about themselves. But the only way you're going to be able to know that, discern that, decipher that, is if you are balanced within yourself. That's the way you'll know whether or not you're feeling what you're feeling or if you're feeling what someone else wants you to feel. It's the only way. Sit still and get, get, get closer to God. Get closer to your ancestors. Get, get closer to spirit. There is a connection that's missing. That's why you feel confused. There's a connection. There's a peace missing. There's a piece missing. It's a piece missing. It really is. That is what the spiritual journey is helping you to discover the missing pieces that were specifically hidden from you on purpose, intentionally. They don't want you to recognize how powerful you are. You are powerful beyond measure. Do you understand that? You are so powerful and magnificent that they created a whole freaking system to keep you down and lock the hell up. That's how powerful you are. So if you found this channel and you looking at this video, baby, let me tell you. And I don't even know how powerful I am yet. I'm still discovering. But I feel it. I know it's there. I just don't know to the extent of what it is. And if you're going through hell at the moment, you're going through challenges, trials, and tribulations, you're being gang stalked, you're being, all that terminology that they use in the spiritual world, but basically it's people coming at you for no reason. Let me just put it point blank, period. Gang stalking is people coming at you for no reason. People that you love, people that you supported, people that you helped for however many years, that's what that is. That is what game stalking is, okay? So if you have that happening in your life at this present moment, understand it's because the devil do not want you to get whatever God's trying to give you. Point blank. You can add your own. Boo! <laughs> okay? You got this. Today is a beautiful day. No matter where you are at in the world, today is a gorgeous day. It's a beautiful day for you. I don't care if it's raining, sunshine. I love both the rain and the sun. Find pleasure in it. Go dance out in the rain if it's raining where you at. I don't care if you've never done it. Maybe you used to do it like me as a child. Go ahead and do that. Do that. I used to play in the rain as a kid. I took my, nie my niece and nephews the other day. We went running outside in the rain. It feels good. Sometimes you got to do what feels good. I ain't talking about the bad stuff like doing crack or nothing. That, that's not permission for that. No, no. That's not stealing from your mama. No, no, no. Don't do those things. I don't care if they feel good. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Do something that feels good to your soul. Find that inner, that inner space that makes you giggle. You know, that makes you giggle. That makes you giggle. That makes you feel good on the inside. That makes you feel alive. 
that makes you feel peace even in the midst of chaos and where you're at right now may be so chaotic you like what is this lady talking about what is this girl talking about what is auntie talking about in the midst of chaos baby you can find that little peace i don't care if it's for 10 minutes sometimes you can only muster 10 minutes if you can do longer than that then do that but 10 minutes of solitude 10 minutes of peace find 10 minutes early in the morning before the world wake up find it you can find it 10 minutes and at night 10 minutes at in the afternoon when everybody sleep whenever you can find it whenever you can squeeze it in find it and do something that make you happy i color too call me a big old kid if you want to it makes me happy brings me peace i can kick my legs up and swing so oh well find what makes you happy darlings this life is meant to be lived, enjoyed, expressed. How are you going to express your individuality today? I have that written on a card in my room as a constant reminder. How am I going to ex express my individuality today? And it could be in a number of things. You can express your in in individuality. Somebody don't want me to say that, why? We all supposed to be individuals. We all are. You are an individual. You were born alone. You're going to die alone. Okay? So learn to be in by yourself. You have to. You have to be an individual. God can't use you if you're not an individual. He can't use me if I'm not an individual. And I was codependent. That goes all the way back to a narcissistic relationship. Go back to some other videos. I don't have time right now. But... So I am relearning to unlearn that stuff. This is crazy. I know it's, it's crazy. I feel you. Yeah, it's crazy. And it may sound crazy, but I bet that's what you're feeling right now, though, ain't you? Sound crazy, but you like, well, how she know my life, huh? We got a lot to do. But God needs us at a specific place, point in time. And I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. It's painful, it's hard, I'm scared. Yeah, I am, I am. But scared ain't never stopped me. Never has. May have delayed me. I am sweating, but the sun beating and it's feeling good. Fear can only delay you. It can't stop God's plan. And I'm learning to accept that. That's also learning that I am protected. So no matter what adversity has come my way, no matter what issues, no matter what people try and throw at me, I'm protected, but I still got to fight. I still got to do what's right. And I got a lot of stuff to do. So. I may be putting out a lot more videos than normal real-time video this is a real-time video I still have some in the Rolodex that's an old time frame no one if, if, if you under 30 you probably don't even know what that is so I don't know I'm sweating though and I'm loving it purifying it get all of it out any who my loves I am sending nothing but peace to your mind, conflict to be resolved, love to be surrounding you, and just a little mustard seed of hope, no matter what you may be going through, okay? Find it. Today is a good day for me, and I have the power to keep it a good day, no matter what anybody say, no matter what anybody do. They're not going to not gonna, they're not gonna stop me from smiling. They've been trying 45 years, I keep smiling though. You want to know what my superpower is? That's it. God gave me a smile. And I love my smile. Can't you tell? Find something you love about yourself. Because this world will try and tell you that you look wrong. You should feel wrong. You ain't dressed right. You ain't got the right education. Bump that. What, what do you like about yourself, okay? Find something you like about yourself. Find one thing. One thing. Maybe you got pretty feet. 
If not, mm, try your hands. I don't know. All right, my beautiful loves. I love you guys. If no one's told you today, I love you. You are important. You are so worth it. You are worth it for yourself. I'm not telling you this for nobody else's. I'm not telling you none of it I tell you for you to be like pointing the finger at nobody. This is all to help you help yourself. Hey, my baby. You ready? Come on in. All right, my beautiful lovelies. I love you. Enjoy yourselves. Have an awesome day on purpose. Okay, clearly he doesn't want to go in. So, but I am. Are you coming? Have an awesome day, guys. Love you.